In this tutorial, we're going to go over a new feature in Toonly called Bulk Operations. Bulk Operations allows you to adjust the properties of multiple items at once rather than individually. So let's take a look. We'll start with titles. You'll see I have two individual titles here. And if I'd like to work with them together, I need to first select them together. And you'll do that by using control click on a Windows computer or command click on a Mac computer. You can also use your mouse and drag over the items that you'd like to select. So now that I have them selected, I can now use the settings here to control them. For example, if I want to remove them, I can do so, or flip them, or bring them forward or backwards. You can also use the settings here to make them larger or smaller, or rotate them. as well as the settings over here in the common text settings panel. For example, let's change our font. And we can change the font size if we'd like. And the opacity if we'd like. Let's put an underlay underneath. Give it a little bit of padding. And let's change the opacity color. So there we have it. We've now made changes to both items at one time. You can do the same with characters and objects. So let's take a look. You'll see I've got a couple characters and a few objects in the scene now. You'll also see that this dolly and bucket are way too big. So we can resize them collectively by selecting them use control click, command click, or use your mouse to select them, and then make your adjustments. So that looks a little bit better, and then we'll just move them down. We can also rotate them should we want to, and make other changes. Same with our characters. So let's command click to adjust them, can resize them, can move them, rotate them, and so forth. There's one more thing I wanted to show you, and that's down here in the timeline itself. If you control or command click multiple items in the timeline, you can move the timeline, move them. So if you wanted them to start earlier, say at one second, instead of at four or five seconds, you simply command or control click the ones you want to move and move them within the timeline. Likewise, if you wanted to change their duration, command click so that you have the ending points just stretch it out. And there you have it, bulk operations in Toonly. Thanks for watching.